Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, the everyday non-expert here, and today I wanted to show you my top 5 comic spec picks for next week, December 8th, 2021. Please give this video a like by clicking that thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel to see more great comic book and collectible content like this, and uh, comment down below. Let me know what you thought about my picks, uh, what kind of picks are you thinking of that maybe I didn't mention. And without further ado, let's get started. And starting off, I wanted to uh, sh include this one as an honorable mention. I don't know how it will do on the secondary market, but it could do fairly well. So I wanted to show you this awesome um, Tales of Mother Goose. This is the Scarface uh, homage, <clears throat> but the real uh, good one, one that I think is could hit is the Pulp Fiction homage right here. So, yeah, that's uh, Mother Tales F Tales of Mother F Goose. Um, I don't know anything about the story. So this is strictly a cover buy and thinking that maybe not many people will know about it and when they see it, they'll want it and that could cause the price to go up. That's all I'm going off of for this. And next is a, another cover buy and this is a uh, one of those, um, I forget what they're called, color wash or something like that, uh, variants of the Red Ranger for Power Rangers 14. This is the 1 in 50. And I actually picked up, uh, pre-ordered one of these for myself. It is an amazing cover, and I think that it could do well in the secondary market. So that's number five, because I'm pretty sure that one will be good. And then after that, we have the Green Lantern, number nine. And it looks like it could be the first appearance of a character who is said to be new but ancient enemy and they're referred to as the anti-guardian so that's kind of the first sort of first appearance uh wise spec pick and after that we have number three and this one's more of a cover buy however it is a um, a number one, which makes it also a key, and this is Batgirl's number one, and then this is the Amato variant, I think I said that right, and I just think that that, if this book heats up, that that's the cover that people are going to want, it'll also be difficult to get in high grade because of the uh, black background, and after that, we have Batman 118 and that one is said to have the first appearance of Abyss and apparently there's also uh, the first debut of a new bat suit so um, we will see if anything oh, I don't know how Batman's been doing on the secondary market I don't think it's been very good but uh, I thought I'd at least let you know. It does have some things that, um, you know, could lead to it being big on the secondary market. And then the big one coming up for this week is my number one. And this is Devil's Reign number one. And it's the first team appearance of Kingpin's Thunderbolts. Now, think about the MCU. Think about how much, and then the what-ifs especially, and how they're... Vi they're uh, they're going away sort of from the comics for a lot of these. Think about how old William Hurt is. He can't play General Ross for much longer. I don't think. So I think it would make sense. They're going to bring in Vincent D'Onofrio right now in Hawkeye. And then they could just do this and have, his first, and have Kingpin have his own Thunderbolt team. And this is the first appearance of Kingpin's Thunderbolts. So, 
It's going to have, I believe, Elektra as Daredevil um, with Kingpin having his Thunderbolts. So I this is kind of a long shot, and it could be a long-term spec if it does hit far down the line in the MCU, years I'm talking. Um, this could be a book worth picking up. Plus, it's a number one, so that's a key just in and of itself. But it does have that first appearance, and it seems like it's a really good story. So I'm really excited for this. All right, everybody, that's going to do it for me today. I hope you enjoyed that video. I tried to keep it short, succinct, to the point, not waste any of your time, unlike my end uh, scene ramblings like this. Uh, but those were my top five spec picks, plus the Mother F. Goose, Scarface, and uh, Pulp Fiction homages as the honorable mention for next week, December 8th, 2021. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give this video a like by clicking that thumbs up button. Subscribe to the channel to see more great comic book and collectible content like this. And comment down below. Let me know what you thought about my picks. Is there anything that you're specking on that maybe I didn't mention? And I'm going to show right here in the end credits a video where you can see my haul from um, December 1st. And enter that giveaway to win um, that book that I'm giving away in that video. I just forgot off the top of my head what it was. So, anyways, thanks again for stopping by, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.